to test that the dispenser is communicating with the mobile network whilst in test mode, press and hold down button 2. The display will show GSM minus 1 followed by GSM plus 2 and then GSM plus 1. If the GSM plus 1 is not displayed, there is no network reception from the SIM card network operator at that location. It may be necessary to use a different network operator. Next, after all the settings have been made and saved, they must be downloaded to the dispenser. Please note that the dispenser does not have to be in the same location as the programming computer in order to download the settings. For example, a family member may program the dispenser on their computer and the settings can then be later downloaded by the family member or a pharmacist directly to the dispenser wherever it is. Open the battery case cover and remove the battery isolating strip from the dispenser. Replace the battery case cover and, if required, secure with the screw provided. Open the dispenser lid. The LCD will display a time. To download the settings, press button 2 for 2 seconds. The dispenser will contact the administration centre and exchange data, including telephone numbers and all the dispenser settings. The display will move through the sequence shown here. Once the dispenser has reverted to the clock, the programming is completed. If required, the settings can be checked manually. Please see the manual settings instructions. Please note that each time the dispenser medication tray is refilled with medication, the dispenser should be reset by pressing button 2. This will update all of the settings, reset the number of doses left in the dispenser and upload the actual dispensing times of the previous medication cycle to the administration centre.